back to the main I'm gonna miss it. That's fine. Ow. Oh no. Oh god. Hang on. So we need to go to the academy. We need to go to the academy and sleep. Or no, I can just go into someone's house. Hang on, let's find a house. We can steal someone's bed. Excuse me, have you got a bed in here? <laughs> bed in here. Oh, there is a bed. Just steal on your bed. Don't worry about it. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Be wonderful. Okay, now, where is the... Okay, so it's just over here. He said the grave closest to the big tree. Like I've done something wrong. Like it's meant to glow, apparently. Very confused. Maybe I can't do this bit yet. As stupid as that sounds, maybe even though he's told me that. Oh, I hit her.
and cut down the little girl. My name is Batterix. I'm a monster who resides here in the humble dwelling below Skyloft. Please allow me to correct one of my populist conceptions. While I'm certainly a monster, I wouldn't dream of terrorizing the people of this town. See, this adorable little girl is the only one who didn't let loose a blood curdling scream at the sight of me. Since she began visiting me here, all I felt positive jubilant. Uh, positively jubilant. You see, my friend hearts only I ah, okay, yes. I assure you, nothing will fill my heart more with the joy of friends to find people on the step. Okay. So the American house is there all the time over okay. Uh -huh. Seems that when humans make other humans happy, the happy humans procure a substance known as a gratitude crystal. Mm -hmm. Gratitude crystals are quite amazing. Looking at them and knowing they have gratitude for. Ah, okay, it's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I have to give him gratitude mm -hmm. crystals. I've heard that you can obtain pure gratitude crystals by helping people solve mm -hmm. their troubles. Okay, so he wants five gratitude crystals. Ah, okay. Right. Forgot about that, dude. Alright. Now we can head to Theron. Oh. That's not a diving point. Oh, go away. Oh, plus I won't let you... F I'm pretty sure they don't let you fly at night, too. Hey. Yo, yo. Oh. So... Okay. We're gonna go sleep. Is there a bed? I'm just gonna go steal someone's bed. <laughs> Excuse me, just having a nap time. Sorry, yeah, um, but no, sorry, just ignore me. I want to sleep till morning. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Very much so. Thank you. Oh, hi, yeah, oh, you're still standing there. Oh, you want something. What do you want? Hello. Oh, but he's talking to say, here's me. My house is terribly dirty. Pippin's all telling me to dust things. Okay, oh! Mm. I get to dust their house! Isn't this wonderful? I love when games want me to do the housework. I love it. What's their house getting? This dusty though. Let's smash your bases. Uh, that's disturbing that she makes that noise. She's enjoying that a little too much, I think. <laughs> you can give me gratitude crystals? Oh, 
Oh, I think I give this to Thingamabob. Thing above. All right, let's go back down and give them the gratitude crystals. You've gathered ten of them. Is that ten including including the five now? Or is that like an, another ten? Hmm. Either way, I've got a new wallet, so that's good. To you again, diving point. All right, time to wait. No, time to head to the sealed grounds. Yay, it's gross. <laughs> Ugh, rough landing. I think I might have broke something. Hey B, seriously, did anyone teach you how to land without crap? Birds, tiny birds, what what are they? Oh god. And what is that thing? <laughs> But how, why, what, where am I? <laughs> what is going on here? Ever since Zelda vanished, you've been zipping in and out of town all in a hurry. I so I figured I'd tell you and it might lead me to Zelda. But this is all so wild. Seriously, what is this, th that thing over there? What are all these, th all these trees? There's so many. It's called a forest, Bruce. Just give it to me straight. Can I, I can take it. Where are we? Is Zelda here? What is the deal with this place? If we're supposed to be nothing but good cars, what is all this? Pat pat. Even though he has been an absolute dick to Link, Link is still comforting him and being like, look, I'll explain it, Bruce. <laughs> You're kind of imploding my mind right now. But I think I get what you, you're you saying. If I got this right, Zelda is down here somewhere and she's okay. She's okay, oh well, that's great. Da -da -da -da. Hearing that is such a huge weight off my mind. You know, bees, this is sort of alright down here. This place needs a name. Oh god. 
a name fitting for this rugged, adventurous wilderness. From now on, we're going to call it Grooseland. Yeah, this is Grooseland. <laughs> Let me see if I got this right. The old lady living in the temple down the road from here knows where Zelda is. I see, right, Bees. Thanks for getting me here. You've done a good job. You can head home. Oh my god. Big Groose will handle the search for Zelda from here. Yep, I'll track her down, save her, and then give her a lift back to Skyloft. <laughs> then when we get back, I'll ask her if she wants to make the whole going out thing official, and the two of us will get some quality time together. Oh my god. Anyway, the point is, your work here is done. I've got it covered from here. Christ. Now it's off to find the old lady you're talking about. Uh, catch you later, bees. Oh my god, Bruce, you are insane. Alright. Nice bugs. Oh, they're new. They're new. Alright, here we go. Let me chuck him off a cliff? The thought had occurred to me. Huh, you gotta be kidding me, Granny. You're messing with me. Say it again, I dare you. I only speak the truth. You are not the one who will save her. The spirit maiden in your Zelda can only be saved by another. Uh, it has been his fate to do this thing and to, in doing so, save us. It was brought decided long ago before he brought crying into this world. <laughs> Shut it, Granny. Don't, dis don't disrespect the Granny, alright? Don't, don't disrespect her. You obviously don't know me well. If you didn't, you wouldn't uh, know if the, anyone's going to save Zelda. It's Bruce. How could it not be me? Plus, if it ain't me, why would I be, even be here? Pfft, if I'm not doing it. Oh my god. Huh? Oh, now I get you. Bees, Granny here's returned to tell you they're going to be the... Oh. What a joke. Look, all I heard so far is a bunch of babbling about Destiny, and that's a load of garbage. I know you, and you're no hero, shrimp. Bruce is not happy, and that makes me happy. Greetings, Bees. Were you able to catch up with Zelda? Ah, I see. So the Guardian was there as well, was she? The one who saw by Zelda's side is known as Impa. She has been sent forth by the goddess to aid Zelda in her quest. The two have travelled somewhere in the order uh, to accomplish the great task of Destiny has set before them. However, now that Impa has destroyed the gate that they use, there is only one way left to find them. You must make use of the harp given to you by Zelda. Tell me, bees, have you attempted to play the harp you've received? My sense is that you have not yet familiarised yourself with it. Very well, I shall teach you how to play it. Listen well and do as I say. First press X to ready your harp. Now, okay. Um, okay. It's not easy. The Ballad of the Goddess. Can you play Despacito? Oh my god. Yes. All of the Despacito. Oh, here we go.
harp you hold is known as the goddess's harp. It's a divine instrument of the goddess who once watched over this land. The melodies it brings li to life have the power to pro uh, produce a variety of strange and otherworldly effects. The great slab standing before you is known as a gate of time. It is the last of its kind in existence, the only portal binding our world to the one where Zelda now resides. If you manage to open the gate and pass through it, you will likely end up in the same place as Zelda, but you need to endure many hardships and put yourself in great danger to awaken the gate from its dormant state. Uh, though your journey will put you in harm's way, bees, you must endure. It is your fate as the chosen hero of the goddess. <laughs> This shaking. I fear the seal has been broken. I expect that it would re react to you as summoning the gate, but I never imagined the seal would break so quickly. Bees, there will be time for explanation later. Now, right, you must hurry to the bottom of the pit outside. Yep, I remember this bit. I think shit's about to go down. What's with all the shaking? The whole ground is heaving. I thought it was supposed to be a solid. It was solid down here. Very quick, bees. Check on the seal spark at the center of the pit. There's nothing natural about these tremors. That monster could free itself at any moment. Approach the pit with caution. Okay. Okay, this uh, this battle's not. The... I knew it. The seal has given way. I'll explain later, but for now it's time for action. We must keep the beast from escaping that pit. We must not reach the temple. I have to pop its toes from memory. Oh, it's not happy. I need to get to its head. Oh, I don't want the net. Um, would strike work. Thank you. Oh, do I? Oh no, I just hit it. I thought I had to Skyward Strike it. Alright, I think it re sprouts its toes. I mean, it's not that intimidating. What it what it ends up being, it's it, 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 it yeah. This isn't the first time you encounter this. Ow. 
not to spoil too much, but yeah, you encounter this thing a couple of times. Is that a shiny? Absolutely, magic. That's right, it. I was gonna say, where did it stop? I missed that. Ah, oh, so now it's getting a little less. I'm running out of time. Now bees. Strike the seal spike with the skyward strike and restore the seal quickly. Alright, they go down and I'm just going to get right up against that, but I have to... There we go. Yeah, that's the seal reinstated for now. Oh. Nice going, bees. Mm -hmm. 
Though the imprisoned had only just begun to awaken and break its bonds, I'm impressed you were able to restore the seal, keeping it captive. Unfortunately, you, only have, you have only succeeded in buying us a little more time in which to act. The behemoth you beat back into the confinement is a horror of unspeakable power. Judging by what I saw, it would not be surprised if the seal gave way again soon. So if you you are left with precious little time to complete the task in which you have been entrusted. Return to the sealed temple bees, there's much to discuss. As you can see, the gate is nothing more than a slab of cold stone for now. It is sleeping. Rousing it from its slumber would require great power. Yes, I believe a shot of holy light from your skyward strike might do it. Ah, sorry to disappoint you, boy, but for you now, your sword lacks the power necessary to awaken the gate. First, you and your sword must grow together. Farron Woods, Elden Volcano, and Lanari Desert. A sacred flame is hidden somewhere in each of these lands. Seek them out and purify your sword in their heat. Only after that, your blade will be tempered by the three fires. It will be fully imbued with the great power for which you search. Clues to finding the sacred flames have been woven into the lyrics of a song precious to your people, the Ballad of the Goddess. These clues are your best hope of finding your way to the flames. Return to Skyloft. Somewhere on your island is one whose knowledge for, of this old song will point you in the right direction. I hate even saying this, but I guess you got all, all figured out, Granny. Me, well, there's nothing to do to, 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 to help Zelda. I'm useless. Ah, you sell yourself short, my friend. You will see in time that you have your own role to play in all of this. Please go on now. Trust in fate to guide your feet. Your mission depends on it, as does Zelda's fate. <laughs> Ballad of Goddess. Based on my projections, like the song Zelda sang on the day of the winging ceremony, I calculate 85% probability that someone associated with the Academy will now be able to provide additional information about this song. So yeah, I'm guessing hit the headmaster and Zelda's father. But I'm going to leave it there. Um, I've been streaming for three and a half hours. I am streaming a lot this week, so I don't want to push myself. Um, we've made a, a, a great deal of progress. Um, I, yeah, but because I'm streaming so much this week, I don't want to push myself. Um, so... We will be continuing this. It won't be until next week, though, because the rest of the week is um, Pokemon-related stuff. Um, but uh, next week we'll be back to a normal sort of schedule, so I can do a bit more of this as well. So, yeah. Hey, Philo. 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 Did you hear the news? They just watched another video. You come and you come and say hello. Look, you come say hello. Not too sleepy. Philo's just tired from all the content he's been in recently, but uh, thank you for watching the video. If you want to support the channel, you can always check out the merch store, Patreon, or make a direct donation to the Streamlabs link in the description below. However, the best way to support the channel is to like, subscribe, leave a comment, let me know what you think of all the content that's been going out. Check me out on Twitch, twitch.tv slash dragonbees. But for now, thank you once again. You're all amazing, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.